In this video we are going to demonstrate connecting the chest belt to the CSX C536X training watch. In the previous video we set up the training watch in the pro user level and we set the time, our date of birth, maximum heart rate and weight. If you have not done that yet please refer to the previous video. The next step is to connect the chest strap to the training watch. Here is the chest strap. We need to adjust the length of the chest strap. You can adjust it using this here. You need to make sure that it fits tightly but it's comfortable and it should stay in place during your exercise. We need to release one of the tabs. So if we turn this over and we look over here I am right handed so when attaching the strap I find it easier to release this left tab. To do that twist and then pull it out. To put the tab back in just insert it through the gap, twist and then push the tab in so it's secure then. So just push it through then pull it out. So we'll gather the elastic up in our right hand and we now need to wet the sensors on the back of the chest strap using water or ECG gel. Personally I do this under a very slow running tap. Some people lick their finger and run it along the sensors but basically you need to wet the left and right sides. So you need to wet this section here and on the right side this section here. Take care not to wet the battery compartment here. So we'll now wet the sensors. So you can see we've just wet the sensors on either side. You then need to place the chest belt directly onto your skin, wrap the chest belt around your chest and insert the tab and twist it. So you wrap it around, insert the tab, twist it and just push it back in so it's a secure fit. Check that the wet sensors are firmly against your skin and that the CSX logo is in a central and upright position. And the chest belt should be positioned like this image. I have attached the chest belt to my chest and we're now ready to sync the chest belt to the training watch. Press the mode button until you are in the heart rate mode. You'll see it will display pulse. And it will show two dashes while it's pairing with the chest belt. And this will take a few seconds. There you can see it's now paired. While the chest strap is being worn, the current heart rate is displayed in the middle. And you can see my current heart rate is 59 BPM. The heart rate symbol on the left flashes if the heart rate is being received by the chest strap. And if a signal is not being received anymore, the heart rate symbol stops flashing and the last heart rate remains in the display. If for some reason you need to resync the chest strap to the training watch, press the mode button several times until you come back to the heart rate mode. So if we press the mode button, it resyncs when you go back into the pulse mode. Pulse is displayed and the training watch will then try to repair with the chest belt. If the training watch is not receiving a signal, make sure the sensors on the strap are wet because it will not work if you have not wet the sensors. In the next video we will walk you through the various modes available in the training watch and demonstrate setting up the training watch for a workout.